Okay, this is a, uh, we thought it was a post-ovulatory metabolic bone disease patient, but she's a metabolic bone disease patient, which is pretty much ovulatory, but not post. Anyway, um, we have uh, gone in and removed a problem. Uh, hopefully this will be the end of the story, but we'll have to wait and see. Anyway, that's it for now. This girl's going to wake up. Slowly but surely. <laughs> And hopefully she'll live a good long life until the next time this, this happens to her. Um, we have actually gone in and fixed her as well. Unfortunately, that was just uh, not enough uh, space in there. And there was a little bit of scar tissue that I couldn't get past to see the ovaries or enough of the at the uh, base. But I think we did good. All right. Later. Bye. Do you want to wake up, little girl? Keep a breathing. There you go. And all them bad drugs will be out of you. It's a matter of opinion. <clears throat> well, I don't know what she took before this happened, but the ones I put in her, all she had to do is breathe and she's good. You want a heat lamp? Actually, it would not be a bad idea. Come on, girl. Hmm? Let's get those out of there. So you don't have to look at those anymore. Those things have taxed you enough. There you go. Yeah, I see you moving your eyes. Oh, but that's a drug-looking chameleon. Oh, yeah. Cask is so soft. This thing here should be hard as a rock. Look at it bending. Is that because of the calcium deficiency? Mm hmm. <laughs> the noise you hear in the other room is Deb looking for a heat lamp. work. <coughs> Just get on it. I don't want to get in front of the camera business. Yeah. 
talk about two seconds from a freak out. <laughs> Much better. He might want to move her over some, but yeah, that's nice and toasty. All righty. You didn't use any towel plants or anything? You nope, we used just sticky stuff. You use these. You want to the hospital next? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sorry enough. <clears throat> well, he said he'd been eating. I told him I might have him if we come tonight or not. Like, he said that he was getting ready to watch Dancing with the Stars, but <clears throat> he watches that religiously, probably more than I do. <laughs> Yeah. I've taken several. I can send them to you. Okay. You don't put an ant towel in your hemoplex, do you? Wouldn't be a bad idea, just in case. Okay. Just do like a regular... Yeah. Um, drape them. I don't believe it's the It's a selfie. But what if you hold somebody else's? If I took your camera and we took a picture, would that be considered a selfie? Yes. But it's not your. It's not. But you're you're holding the camera. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Knowing this will. I'm not really a selfie. Uh, knowing this yeah. will eventually be public. A selfie, by definition, is when you pick up a camera and you take a picture of yourself. If someone takes a picture of you, it's not a selfie. But what if me and you took a picture and I held your camera? You it's stop. a selfie. Get yourself. Get it yourself. But if you're not holding your camera, how could it be a selfie? No, 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 no. no. You're taking a picture of I'm yourself. I'm finding the loopholes. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're in a loophole to everything. And I found them. Come on, girl. I need to see you a little, a little bit more awake. Huh? You must be a Democrat. Oh, gosh, no. <laughs> no, ma'am. <laughs> <laughs> I'm from it. Finding the loopholes. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I never deleted those emails. <laughs> <laughs> Laura, did you do anything to correct the... Um... Yeah. They started, I think, super calcium. Like, everything is drenched in it. Okay. This girl's looking up enough. Ordinarily, I might wait to see them get a much higher stance, but since she is actually a metabolic bone disease patient, if you can see her cast right there bending, that's just not supposed to happen. So she has soft bones, and even on a good day, she would not be able to stand up and have a high stance. So this butt is awake as I'm going to be able to see her tonight. Uh, we're going to put her to bed in just a minute. Her owners have a lot of work to do. The good news is all the little parasites are gone. And uh, she's got a good stand, stands a good chance of healing at this point in time. All right, that's it for now. Those are not grapes. Do not eat them. Scrambled eggs. Oh, yeah, I like yolk. I like scrambled eggs. <laughs> Daisy might have a field day. Save them for mom. She might want them. All right, later. <laughs>